you're probably thinking to yourself, this is the second video this guy's put out in the same day. It's gotten into this guy. Who's he think he is? My name is Patrick. Welcome to Bikes and Briar. Welcome back. I just put out a video, I don't know, two, three hours ago, maybe four hours ago. Housekeeping, as they call it. You guys know what this is. Missouri Meersham, country gentleman. What resides inside is the Peter Stokeby uh, cherry. I'm glad I only bought one ounce of this. It's okay. The reason why I'm chatting with you again tonight is because this box just showed up at my doorstep. I did not expect it. I just ordered this on Monday night from J.M. Boswell. I've been wanting to get one of his pipes for ever since I started doing this. Um, been looking at his pipes and um, there's just something about them. Handmade the old school way. And um, I didn't know they sold out as fast as they do sometimes within just a few minutes, 15, 20 minutes. Um, I was online a couple weeks ago and uh, it was a Monday night. I just happened to be on their website checking stuff out. And um, I saw a couple pipes and I scrolled through and uh, well, I didn't know how to, I didn't know that there, well, I saw the drop down box, but I didn't realize that you needed to use that drop down box to be able to see uh, the latest um, additions onto their website. So I just, you know, clicked on their pipes and nothing showed up except a gift card at the bottom. Um, so I called them up. I said, hey, um, you know, what's going on with your website? You're supposed to have pipes on Monday, blah, blah, blah. And the lady that I, lady that I spoke to was super sweet, really nice. And she said, yeah, um, Unfortunately, they sell out really fast. So you gotta be on it right at five o'clock on Monday, Eastern Standard Time. I'm in California, so three hour difference. Um, so I said, all right. So I set a reminder on my phone, 4.45, go on JM Bo Boswell's site. If you're on their Instagram page, if you follow them on Instagram, you will see that um, earlier on Mondays, they post I point out. Uh, they post um, all the, well, almost, I realized this, almost all the pipes on Instagram. Just, it's one post and you just swipe through and you can see the majority of their pipes. Um, I checked out their pipes that morning or that mid-afternoon or whatever, and um, there wasn't any of that really uh, caught my attention but um, I thought they were cool. There were a couple that were pretty interesting. Um, but I jumped on right at 5 p.m. And lo and behold, there was a pipe that was not shown on their Instagram page. And um, Mr. J.M. Boswell called it a uh, black coal stout pot. I don't have any pot shaped um, pipes, but I really liked the muscularity of it in the photos um, that he posted. There's some nice uh, cherry blossom trees that are in full bloom behind him. And um, it's really, it's beautiful. And uh, has a rusticated finish. And uh, I thought I'm gonna swipe it. It was, um, um, a little expensive for uh, my first artisan pipe, my first handmade pipe, but um, I thought, what the hell? I mean, I don't know if I'm gonna get, uh, I don't know what my chances are of waiting 
to get something else. So, um, you know, I'm so new to this. So I figure if I'm going to jump on this train, I better jump on it. I'm not going to sit there and wait because then you sit there and wait and then you go, oh, I could have, should have, would have, or I could have had this. Um, and, you know, maybe that pipe never comes around that strikes your fancy that you like. So, um, but this really stood out to me. It looked really interesting and um, I pulled the trigger on it and it showed up within just a few days. I'm, um, they're, these guys are out of Pennsylvania and I'm in California, I'm on the West Coast. Um, so this showed up fast, it's Thursday night. Um, you know, this was Monday evening. So they got this, they got this to me really quick. I've ordered tobacco from them before and I think it's taken like two weeks to get to me. So I don't know if they prioritize this because it's a pipe from them. Um, but if, uh, if the Boswell people ever see this video, thank you for shipping it to me so quickly. I'm going on vacation for two weeks to the East Coast on Wednesday, and I was really hoping that this would show up before then. Um, it would have sucked to wait two weeks while I'm on vacation to, to get home and, and finally see it. So uh, I'm, I'm really happy. So we're gonna do an op we're gonna do a box opening because I don't know what's inside. I don't know what it looks like, and this is gonna be uh, a new thing for both of us. So. I can use my check tool. This is pretty exciting for me. See that there? Jam Boswell. Pretty nice. And I also ordered two more ounces. I also ordered two more ounces of Northwoods because it was really, really, really enjoyable when I tried it. The one time that I tried it, so got some nice Northwoods. Even the outside of the bag, it smells really good. Mm. I love this stuff. This is uh, my first, um, I guess it's an English blend. I'm not sure. Don't quote, you know, don't quote me on this. I'm probably wrong, but um, I think it's an English blend. It might be a, a hybrid of some sort. There might be some Cavendish in here, but um, excellent. But don't take my word for it. Try it if you haven't tried it. Um, I'm a newbie, so what do I know? So it comes with this in this box that is bursting open. <laughs> it's not really staying open at all, but um, this is what it looks like. It's pretty cool. A hands-on procedure in old world tradition, it says. And it's got some uh, information on the back. I'll read it to you. <clears throat> it says, what is a customer? A customer is the most important person in any business. A customer is not dependent on us, we are dependent on them. A customer is not an interruption of our work. They are the purpose of it. A customer does us a favor when they come in. We aren't doing them a favor by waiting on them. A customer is part of our business, not an outsider. A customer is not just money in the cash register. They are human beings with feelings and deserve to be treated with respect. A customer is a person who comes to us with his needs and his wants. It is our job to fill them. A customer deserves the most courteous attention we can give them. They are the lifeblood of this and every business. Thank you, J.M. Boswell's Pipe and Tobacco. Not a lot of companies believe in that. That's really cool. Sorry about the plane flying over right in the flight path of uh, San Jose Airport. Um, let's do some box opening, shall we? All right. Looks like it separated the, uh, the stem. Put that aside. Got 
this nice bag. It's like a felt. I'm a car guy, I'll call it Alcantara. It's Alcantara. <laughs> it's more like a velvet bag or, yeah, I don't know what you would call this. Just comes in this bubble wrap to keep it safe on its journey across the United States. Sit that down. I'll show it to you first. Thick walls. I guess that's why they call it a pot. Really nice stem. Pop it in. Goes in really nice. It says on the back or on the bottom, GM Boswell 2023. And it looks like it's a sitter. I don't know if you can't see it, but, but it sits down no problem. I have to admit it's a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be. Um, it's still quite stout i mean there's a reason why he calls it a uh, black coal stout pot it's um it's nice it's sturdy it is pretty muscular looking it's just a little shorter than i thought it would be <laughs> the photos always make things look bigger what is that the camera adds 10 pounds something like that anyway it's beautiful and I'm happy with it, it looks good you can see that my upside down I don't know. pretty cool pipe really excited to try this I'm not gonna try it tonight or right now but um, what do you think what do you think good Feels good. Reaching for it. Feels nice. Really nice. Got everything I need here in this box. Got some pipe cleaners. Oh. It's better than using a golf tee. It does say made in China on this. It's stamped made in China on the side, but still it's cool. That is cool. Comes wrapped up like that. Got a box of JM Boswell matches, which is very cool. And I was gifted with an ounce of Jam Bodwell, Boswell's chocolate cream. Whew, and boy, does it smell sweet. Oh man. Have any of you guys tried this? If you have, let me know. Let me know what you think of it. Let me know what you think of the Northwoods too, I'm curious. Well, that's the box opening. A lot of fun. Hope you enjoyed it. Next video is going to be about motorcycles. We're going to go over the three bikes that I have. A um, few of you have commented. Um, a couple of you have reached out on Instagram. Um, a few people have emailed me directly. Um, I guess some people aren't comfortable with uh, conversing over YouTube. 
Got my uh, chamomile tea here. Hmm, that's good. Um, but yeah, a few of you have uh, requested that I talk about my bikes, and so be happy to do that. I'll post uh, some photos and, um, and tell you what I'm currently riding. I'll give you a brief history of the bikes that I um, have ridden. And if you guys want a, want a, a story about each one, I, I'm happy to do that too. Um, I don't know how interested in bikes you guys are, but this is a bikes and Briar channel. So we're gonna be talking about both. And um, I know that uh, some of you guys have expressed that you used to ride and you don't anymore and uh, that you'd like to ride or um, whatnot. So if you guys wanna live through me, it's all good. Um, happy to help you with that. I had uh, one of my subscribers, his name's Michael Reyes, reach out to me and ask um, if uh, my, my, one of my topics could be how to get your spouse to say yes. Um, I, asked to, I asked him if he could clarify whether that meant getting into motorcycling, purchasing a motorcycle, or having her as a passenger. And he confirmed and said that it was about purchasing a bike. So we can talk about that as well. Um, encouraging your partner, spouse, girlfriend, boyfriend to support you in getting a motorcycle and purchasing a bike. Um, that's a very important topic. And a lot of people, when I was teaching the MSF course, asked me this question. A lot of people were um, taking the MSF course on the down low, they weren't telling their family, they weren't telling their loved ones that they were doing this. And they, during our Q&A, question and answers time, um, I'd often get people asking me, how do I break the news? How do I tell them that this is what I'm doing um, so that it's accepted? And so we can talk about that too. I um, think I have a pretty good idea of how to go about doing that. And so we can discuss that. We can discuss all kinds of topics. I don't want every video I have to be a half hour, 40 minutes long. So I'm gonna have to find a way to kind of uh, portion it out um, as it is. I think this video is almost 20 minutes. So um, if you guys don't mind long videos, let me know. If you um, prefer shorter videos, let me know. Um, I wanna thank every single subscriber that subscribed to my channel in the last 48 hours. Um, a lot of it came down to uh, Bass Piper who gave a shout out to me on his channel and I am very grateful for that. Thank you so much. Really appreciate that. It helped tremendously. Um, it brought a lot of people to my channel, checking it out, liking it, uh, commenting it. I have a ton of comments. And if you took the time to comment and you were constructive and you asked questions, I will, you spent the time to do that, I will definitely spend the time to respond to you. Um, unless you're negative or something like that, then I'm not gonna bother, but anybody who goes on my channel, watches the video and takes the time to write me, send me a message, I'm going to take the time and return the favor. It's only fair. And uh, I just wanna thank you all for taking the time to offer tips to uh, welcome me to the community. You guys have been so warm and welcoming and I just really, really appreciate, appreciate that. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much. Look forward to chatting with you guys more in the future and we'll see what the future brings. Have a good night. It's good to talk to you.